pencil is a very simple and popular material to use. So obviously we can draw and write with it. Um, all we have to do is put the pencil down and go ahead and make a line. We use pencils because they're very easy to erase, either with the end of the pencil or a regular kind of eraser. Or if you can get a hold of clay erasers, they're kind of nice. They're called kneaded erasers sometimes. And you rub on the surface, and the nice thing about them is they don't leave any crumbs behind. There's different kinds of pencils. Most people will use their regular old classroom pencils. Um, but we also have some specialty art pencils too. Um, and these will have some letters on them and numbers. So this one is 5H. So that means it has a hard lead. Um, and because the lead is hard, when it draws lines, they tend to be light. The opposite end of the spectrum could be like an 8B. B stands for soft. When I press with that, um, it makes a much darker, bolder line. These are really good for shading. Um, when you're using a pencil, you want to try and work relatively lightly, because if you do press hard, it's much harder to erase. Even with a good clay eraser, you can see the lighter circle got erased, and the darker one, we can still see a line there. So it's important to work lightly when you're working with pencil. When you're ready to shade, um, let's say I've wanted to turn this into a sphere. I could go ahead and shade on the one side. Go back and make it a little darker. Maybe go over it a third time. And then I can use a tortillion, which is rolled up paper. That can be used to kind of blend stuff and fade it. Or you can also take a tissue and fold it in half about six times. That's two, three, four, five, six times. Then you use the corner, and that can also be used to blend and shade. So pencils are a really nice tool to kind of be able to use. They erase nicely, um, but they should be generally used lightly when you're gonna be using another material on top of it. Like if I wanted to trace all of this with a marker, colored in with a crayon, I might not necessarily want to see the pencil at the very end. So working lightly helps you get through the project better.